away video. Recently in my life, eh, it's too robotic. <sighs> All right, I'm at work. It's been a stressful day. Whenever you have stress or something, a place of discomfort, a normal feeling is, how do I get out of this discomfort? And for me, I've been able to realize that my discomfort is being directly um, caused by work because the job that I'm at now is somewhat cool. I mean, it's really cool on one hand, but just having bosses that tell you what to do is a very frustrating experience. And um, the incentive structure where I work right now isn't trending in a good direction. Like I'm getting more and more responsibility and more stress, more uncertainty in my work. Just we're growing so fast and it's like things are getting chaotic and I don't like chaos. And the other part behind that is that my compensation isn't going up. So on one hand, I'm having more work, I'm having more stress. And on the other hand, my wage is stagnant. So that's a very frustrating thing. And then with that, you kind of, I get in this mental headspace of every time that my boss asks me to do something, it's like, ah, you know, like, you know, it, it triggers that, that negative emotion that's been built up by feeling like there's an energy exchange imbalance, like basically what they hired me to do originally, they paid me X amount for, but now that you know, I've sort of proven myself, they're giving me more and more things, but you know, the compensation Y hasn't changed. So X has gone up and Y stayed the same and, and sort of feeling like that's inequitable and, and that's not fair. And, um, but anyway, anyway, so anytime like I interface with my boss or like I have like more tasks and X gets higher and higher, it just triggers this negative emotion that I have built up around the experience of feeling that the, the energy trade-off is inequitable. And so today has been a particularly challenging day. I'm just very much in sort of an annoyed headspace and not feeling, you know, feeling like I want to just be like, cookie. <laughs> Uh, right? Like, you guys know what I mean. Um, sometimes in our head it's just like, I just, it'd just be so much easier to quit. But like, that's also not what I want from my character. Like, I want to be able to persist. But the thing is like, I want more control over my life. I want to ultimately be in charge and, um, you know, making the own my own decisions. And like, if, if I'm going to be mad at somebody, I want to be mad at myself not mad at a boss or mad at a situation. Like I want control. So if, if something doesn't feel right, like I'm the one in charge of making it better. Um, so anyway, while I was making this video and the whole point of this is that I have the negative catalyst, right? And I want to get away from that, but I know that quitting is not the answer because then I just don't have any money and nothing else is lined up and through quitting, I won't have solved any of my problems. Rather, I'll have created a whole new set of problems. So I don't want that. But then, you know, as I'm sitting here with this like discomfort and, and this like agitation, I don't know what action to take. And I feel like that is so common among people in, in this situation. It's like, I know I don't want what I have now, and I have an idea of what I would like to do, but it's like, what is, what is the action that I can take today that will move me closer to, you know, that end goal. And, um, it's so easy to get lost in not knowing what action is most important. So it's like, Oh, I can get online and watch videos or read blogs about, you know, entrepreneurship or whatever, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, none of that probably is what I need to be doing. Like there, there are actions that I need to be taking. There are steps, but I just, 
in this moment, I don't know what they are, and um, that's very frustrating to me. So uh, I'm sure a lot of you have this experience because I know not liking what you do for work is a very common theme in our society, and um, and it's a tricky one to get out of, and it's just not totally clear how to do it because if we knew how to do it we would have done it so it's like now i have to step into the discomfort of the unknown and really ask for help i really need to ask for help and and um understand that like you know the the direction i go it may not be perfect even though it's like this is what i think i want i think i want to be my own boss as i go in that direction like I'm my own boss, like I'm sure there are going to be stresses that I didn't anticipate. And then maybe I look back at being an employee and I'm like, being an employee was kick ass because I just got a steady paycheck. I didn't have to worry about anything. I did my work and then I was done. Um, you know, sure there were things that weren't ideal about it, but like I prefer that lifestyle over the lifestyle of, you know, an entrepreneur who's the boss. Um, but I just want to be able to make that decision. So, uh, Anyway, sorry for bitching, but I feel like I feel like a lot of people have this problem. So hopefully that helps like clarify where you're at and trying to figure out what your next steps are that you need to take that are actually actionable and will move you in the direction of your dreams. So anyway, have a good day. Talk soon.